Um, my name is Ethel Kamkuta and I love to call myself Ethel Kams, a Zambian gospel artist. Born in a family of five and the second born in that family. Well, um, I'm just one simple person that was brought up in a Christian home. Ethel is in the military. Believe it? She's in the military uh, as a soldier there in the Zambia National Service. So I have loved it so much and so proud of it that I'm a soldier. So tell us more about your music. Do you have an album? Yeah, I have one album. I have done an album that was produced in 2016 and the title of the album is I'm a Living Testimony. In that album it's comprising of eight songs and the first song in that album is God's Love which is one of my favorite songs. Okay. Do you have any music videos? The music videos are about four musical videos. Uh, God's Love, there's a fly for a book. There is also Ndino Noka. There is uh, also Yesu Mwebe. Okay. So of those music videos, which one do you want to show to the people on this segment? Okay, I would love you to show case God's Love, my yes. favorite. God's Love. Yes. Uh, awesome. So um, what inspired you to Single okay, my inspiration began from my mother, who most of the times when we were growing up, when I was at the age of five, she would uh, expose us to a platform of showcasing out poems, memory verses, and as well as singing. So she is one of the persons that pushed me to start doing music. So, um, do you have anything lined up, any concerts that people should look out for, or any launch? Are we expecting an album launch or any concerts? Okay, uh, 2020 is the year that will be full of uh, FL's album launch, concerts, because I'm planning to work on a second album. Uh, so 2020, expect more of concerts for Ethel. What, is, what Christmas message do you have for people out there? People that love your music, people that get ministered by your music? Okay, to my fans out there, I love you so much. And um, I'm so inspired and blessed by your support. And the Christmas, this Christmas, I want you to celebrate it. Oh, for G.O.D. as we all know that we are celebrating in our Christ. So I want you to, to be connected to the Spirit of God, to be connected, to spend it just full of appreciating this life that God has given us. So it is what FL is expecting from all of you, my fans out there, even the people out there who are just knowing FL at large. That's the message for you. So, um, of, of those music videos that you told us, which one really means that to you as an artist, the ones that you've done? Okay, uh, I think God's love ministers so much to me because uh, I've reflected back to how my life has been and why I exist today. And it gives me an assurance to say it's all about the love of God. That is why we're still to, I'm still alive today and you are still alive out there. There are many things that we may pass through.
but indeed the hand of God is always sufficient for, for us. The life, it's, it's really a great blessing that one can, can see and know that the hand of God is available for us. So that song is really so, so much for me. I've testified about the goodness of God. I've testified about how God is himself, how he operates himself. So I love that song so much. Awesome. Yeah. So uh, where can people find your music? Like if you want to buy your album? Okay. My music, you can find it on YouTube. You just type Ethel and the name of the song, the videos which are there, there is God's Love. There is Indino Noka, there is His Life for a Book, there is Yesu Kumwele. Then you can also find my songs at uh, Kulima Tower Bus Station. You can also find my music at Christian Voice, Yasani Radio. You can also get to find those songs. And personally, you can contact me as well to get my music. How can they reach you on your social media? Okay, and also the Facebook page is FL Camps, and the other page is also Rejoice Cave Camps. So you can actually find me my page out there talking about I'm a Living Testimony album so far and the new album for 2020. Yeah. So locally, it inspires you. Which gospel artist do you look up to? So when, when you are alone, you, you get inspired by that particular artist. Which artist is that? Okay, uh, I'm actually blessed by many artists to say. They are all a blessing to me. I have learned a lot from them. But, um, okay, I've looked up to an inspiration of uh, Joyce Mwanza because by then I was in that time of the Joyce Mwanza, Miriam, those were artists that were there at that time I was trying to work on an album. So I've looked up to, to those people up to now and many, many more coming up for me. And international is which possible artists? Okay, international wise. Uh, I look up to Snatch as one of the artists. I've also looked up to I've also looked up to Don Moyen. Okay. Yeah, so I'm actually pleasant. Yeah. So um, what do you do besides singing like for fun? What do you do for fun as what do you do for people who like to know what you do? Do you love swimming? Do you love horses? Do you love I don't know what do you love? Okay, um, Ethel, I love to I love to spend time in quiet places where I would like sit down and reflect on what I need to work on. I also love partying in places where it's when it times for partying. I love to do that, and I think I'm a noise maker. Somehow, I love. Are you talking about going to nightclub? What kind of partying? Parties is in kitchen parties. I love such. I also love to spend time as in going for picnics. So I love such. And then uh, I think I also love to joke. Wherever I am, I love to make people smile, laugh. Yeah, just that. And then um, I I love to cook. <laughs> I love to cook. I love discovering how to cook, this and that, so, yeah. Interesting. Well, it's been uh, awesome knowing you and you know, on this segment, you know, as you know your artist. We hope to interview you again when you have something new for the people that love you. Do more and more of it. Sure. All right.